Com. Now to the story of a living legend. We want to introduce you to Sergeant Major William Webb. He served in the 1st Black Paratrooper Battalion during World War II and was a special forces in Vietnam. The 94-year-old veteran told 7 Eyewitness News reporter Madison Carter that he has a message to share with our youth. This is when I became a sergeant major in the, in the Army. William Webb was 16 years old when he lied about his age to leave Buffalo and enlist in the Army. All my friends that was older than me was all leaving, going to the military I want to go to. He spent quite a few years there. I was, I was only in there 32 and a half years. <laughs> and in that time, saw a lot. Well, I, ma I made the Normandy invasion. June 6, 44, I was, I was part of the invasion fleet. You never forget it. It was a time in his life where he says he was fighting for more than just his life and our freedom. Well, hey, we're fighting three wars. The German, the Japanese, and segregation. And we're still fighting segregation. Sergeant Major Webb at the time was part of the 555th Parachute Infantry Battalion, a group of men from Buffalo that became the first black paratroopers in American history. Yeah, people call it Afro-American, but we're not called, we were Negroes. The triple nickels, once inactivated, were transferred to the 3rd Battalion 505 Parachute Infantry Regiment. For every year, Corporal Billy Webb, They'd go on to be transferred throughout the 82nd Airborne Division to form the first integrated division in the U.S. Army. It was rough, but we made it. Webb says he kept re-enlisting. I like being in the military. Because unlike at home, at least overseas, the fight was tangible. Like I said, we was fighting segregation. At least at the Germans, like a shoot back. Today, at 94, when he reflects on his military service, he says he only wishes our children could understand why he spent most of his life serving. I helped make it possible for them to be where they're at now, but they don't, they don't listen, they don't care. He wants to see our youth join forces. They're not trying to work together. And continue the fight he started in 1943. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we proved to the white man that the black man could do the same thing he was doing. Madison Carter, 7 Eyewitness News. Sergeant Major Webb, thank you for your service.